Hey, what's going on guys? It's Joe or Eternal and in this video we get two back-to-back -back spicy nuke gameplays. Now, um, before we get too far into the video, I want to let you guys know we are doing a 5,000 care giveaway that we started in our last video. All you gotta do is subscribe with alerts on, like the video, drop a comment, the usual. And I uh, also want to let you guys know we will be live on Twitch for about two to three hours when this video gets released. So come by, hang out. We're going to be doing giveaways all stream as well. Um, link will be in the description for that. Now, um, the reason for this uh, this video is I just actually got deployed in Clan Wars for 24-7. I'm in the 24-7 clan, if you didn't know. And uh, I've actually taken a break from the last few just because, uh, you know, when I did my rebrand for this channel, um, you know, I was previous previously Limitless, now we are Eternal. Um, so when I did that rebrand, I kind of took a break from Krunker for about uh, maybe a month or so. Um, and I was just, you know, obviously not doing clan wars during that time. Also, mad respect for 24-7 for uh, keeping me in the clan, even though I wasn't playing Krunker for about a month. That's pretty fire. Um, but now I got asked again, hey, you want to get deployed? And I was like, well, you know, I guess so. So uh, I was playing Krunker for about, I don't know, maybe two hours straight, to be honest with you. Just literally in pubs going off. And, uh, you know, I was feeling pretty good today. My aim was feeling pretty snappy, feeling pretty good. I was popping off nukes left and right. I think I got like maybe 10 nukes today or something like that. I don't even know. Um, before this video, I mean. And um, I actually broke my record for most kills in a pub, which uh, I got 69 kills and died three times in a game. Unfortunately, I did not record that, uh, which is kind of upsetting because that was an insane gameplay. Um, I actually got a double nuke in that gameplay as well. So literally an insane gameplay. But unfortunately, it was not recording. I was actually talking to somebody at the time. Um, so that was a rip. But this gameplay still pretty good and so is the next one um so you know i want to show you guys that you know i want to do a little bit more gameplay content we do a lot of you know different content here on this channel but uh, i want to switch up a little bit like i said and just kind of do a bit more gameplay because i do think i actually am a pretty good player most times and uh you know i want to show that off a bit more because i don't really get to show it off too much on youtube um now as you saw we actually did get the nuke um i was just trying to go for a double nuke actually um, so I was kind of focusing more on that than the nuke that I got, but uh, we got throwing knife So I was like, ah, oh, you know what? We got to call that bad win now, but uh, Kind of unfortunate um, Speaking on throwing knives I actually do like throwing knives in general that you know the fact that it's in the game But at the same time it is kind of frustrating sometimes when stuff like that happens um, I also I think I start popping off here soon too. Uh, maybe not right the second but pretty soon you know, I get in a nice little spawn trap area and I just start going off. Um, this map is really bad with spawn traps actually, um, which you'll see me doing here in a moment. So take note of that. If you wanna get better at the game, um, this is one way that will definitely help you. If you have somewhat decent aim and you're camping where I'm camping right now or sitting where I'm sitting, you can actually get a pretty nutty spawn trap going, which is what I'm doing right here. And uh, you know, as long as you, like I said, just got some good aim, you should be good to go. So as you can see, you know, they're basically just spawning in back to back here and I'm just going off on them pretty much. Um, so yeah, it was it was feeling pretty good this game. I was feeling pretty good. I think I could have got a double nuke, honestly, if I didn't die. But, uh, you know, it happens. What can you do? Because right now I'm on a 16 kill streak, and I think I would have, uh, you know, kept it obviously if I didn't die. So we could have had a double, but that's all right. We were running a little bit short on time to this game. So it's unfortunate, but almost, almost had it. I think I actually pulled the double nuke the day before uh, yesterday as well when I was playing. Um, another thing to keep note of, by the way, if you notice on that last kill that I just got, uh, there was actually a player further out in the distance there and then the close one. And the player that was close to me actually wasn't even paying attention. So what I'm talking about here is um, basically target swapping. Um, if there's two targets in front of you and one of them is either not looking at you or extremely low, it might be worth it for you to actually uh, swap to the uh, further target or the one that is a little bit further away, I should say, and uh, and then kill the one closer to you. So that's something that I do a lot actually when I'm playing just based on muscle memory, but um, that's something that can help you improve your gameplay, I think, if you're trying to kill multiple people at once. Now, again, in this gameplay, um, we are playing Kill Confirmed, which I actually hate Kill Confirmed, but again, it was kind of just uh, what got picked, so, you know, and this is a back-to-back -back gameplay. Now, when you're playing Kill Confirmed, um, another thing that can help you uh, be better at the game is I know all the spawns on all the maps, so that's one thing you should do. If you don't know all the spawns, you should learn all the spawns. That's just something you should do to improve your gameplay. Um, 
and when knowing all the spawns, um, especially in kill confirmed, it's a bit easier actually, because they pretty much will spawn away from wherever your team is spawning. So if you see your teammate over there, they're not going to spawn over there. They're going to spawn, I guess, closer to you or wherever. So right now I'm, you know, pretty much majorly spawn trapping these guys, which is kind of unfortunate. Um, and then I know they switched spawns here because, you know, my teammate kind of ran away and I killed them. So I had a feeling they would switch, which they did. But, uh, you know, this is just another example of knowing spawns, knowing how to play, and uh, it helps you out a lot, actually. So that's pretty much what I'm doing here. Um, I pretty much knew for a fact I would get a nuke this game. I was actually trying to see if I can get a double this one as well, but I could not because unfortunately, you know, there wasn't enough players. You pretty much need a stacked lobby, honestly, if you're going for double nukes. And this was obviously not a stacked lobby. So that's unfortunate, but it happens. Um, also, on a different note, speaking of the streams, uh, again, I just want to say thanks for all the support from you guys um, on the YouTube channel and anyone else that's just from the streams in general. Um, it's been absolute insanity recently on the streams, man. We've been growing like crazy so rapidly recently, just going nuts, man, and it's been a blast. I've actually had the most fun I've had streaming in a long time recently, so I appreciate that. Um, before I did my rebrand, I really wasn't enjoying streaming that much. But ever since I rebranded, I've literally been loving the streams and having, like I said, so much fun every freaking time. And uh, I know a few of you guys are some huge supporters recently of the channel, so I appreciate that if you guys come by, you know, support the channel. You know, whether that be with subs or whether that be with just being there in general, so thank you. But, uh, yeah, man. Um, I'm a little bit bummed about the coin flips. I'm not really able to do coin flips anymore, if you guys didn't know that, um, so that's kind of unfortunate. Um, just because it's kind of against the rules for Crunker for content creators to do that. So, you know, rip. Also, that triple kill, pretty clean. Let's go. It always feels good to get a nice triple or quad kill. Um, but uh, the good news is I have my inventory, you know, sitting pretty good. We got my inventory sorted out. I have a lot of nice guns, you know, got the van to black again like I used to have. So I'm pretty happy with that. And, uh, you know, it's just what it is. But hopefully something else fun will come out in Crunker soon. I've been kind of hoping for that. Um, I know that there is the possibility of having like the survival mode type thing um, coming out soon, I believe, uh, for Crunker. So that would be pretty exciting when that comes out and hopefully they come out with some other stuff. Um, as far as the charity stream goes, which is uh, something that I want to do myself, um, I will be doing a, a charity stream, but I'm going to wait a little bit because we just had one, you know, the Crunker just uh, had their own. So I'm going to wait a little bit, you know, let everyone uh, <laughs> restock their wallets and just have a little break from that. And then when the time is right, we will do a charity stream. And of course, I will announce that um, as much as I possibly can to uh, make the stream as big as I possibly can. So that should be a lot of fun. I'm excited for that. Um, and I'm thinking about actually doing a market flipping series. So let me know if you think I should do that in the comments. Anyway, hopefully you enjoyed the video. I will see you guys in the next one. Peace out.